Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to an episode with the Cooperators. We're on Halloween. That what? Shit. Did Halloween I month. We're on the Halloween month, doing our Halloween special, uh, playing Resident Evil. We'll the, do re the remake remastered. So remake remastered. So this is like the third remake. The, it's R E R E R E. Triple R three. Triple R three. I don't even know. R three. <laughs> so, Joe will be playing this, yep. and how are you going to be playing this, Joe? Very unique? Uh, yes. I'm thinking knife only. Not, really? Mostly. Okay, so what's the display going to be? Wide or original? Uh, we're gonna, well, we can do widescreen. Okay. Uh, what's the controls going to be? Alternate or original? Uh, fuck tank controls. How do I, that? do, like climbing a mountain. So hard, what? normal, or easy. I was going to say, what does this have anything to, to do? Because I remember these questions being in the first game. It was like, uh, how do you uh, like your games? Like climbing a mountain for Phil, oh. but take a lot of work. Or like going on a hike, good exercise, but not too str uh, strenuous. Or like a walk, you can relax and enjoy yourself. Do I dare do knife only with Chris on hard? Well, what? I'm not going to be killing many so, things. Wait, wait, wait. What's easy, normal, and hard? Easy... All of your, like, say if you pick up for ammo, right? It doubles the amount you pick up. Okay. Enemies die a lot quicker. There's less okay. enemies. Okay. Normal. There's a f there's normal amount of enemies, normal stuff. Hard, more enemies, less items. And they're, they're harder to kill. And apparently you said you want to do this knife only. Yeah. Well, I'll leave it up to you. I may or may not, but I kind of want to do hard. All right, so climb up that mountain and fulfill, but it takes a lot of work. E normal and easy as for pussies. And apparently this is a questionnaire uh, uh, for a psychiatric evaluation for Raccoon City police officers. Hmm. I don't know, that's what it says. <laughs> You're approved! Now, so, Chris with his lucky penny. Chris is going to be lonely. Or we could do Resident Evil 5, Chris. Or we could do... Wait, yeah, wait, wait, you had, you had BS BSAA... Wait, that's Resident Evil 5? No, it's Resident Evil 6, Chris. Five or six. No, matter. that's six. Because yeah, six, he had all the gear and everything. Five, he just had, like, what did he have? He just had a, mach he had a machete in his back and uh, another BS. There he are never... more costumes, but I'm not doing it on uh, New Game Plus. Because if I do... You know what? Fuck it. Let's do it New Game Plus. I don't get stuff, but there's the forest the zombie. The where what? he's run Forest, where he's running around the mansion. Oh, Joseph Forest. And I can't kill him. So that'll be more interesting. Well, so Once what, again. So, so with the eyes, is like fucked up. Like, oh, that's also very easy. <laughs> where if you truly are a bitch. <laughs> but apparently you're just gonna do this on hard. So what costumes do you have? Uh, 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 so that's a classic. That's uh, Code Veronica. That's just po for this game. Okay. And there's... BSSA? Yeah. So default, Code Veronica, alternate, six. Well, what does Jill have? I'm only curious. Cla uh, classic? Uh, alternate? Sexy? Uh, RE3. That also looks good. And BS... Uh, AA. Five. Five, I remember. That's it? Yep. Okay. So you're gonna go Chris Lonely with his lucky penny. I like his high school picture on the bottom. That is a nice picture, yeah, he's actually. got, like, his hair there, and you get, like, the little... Little... Come out, like... Hey, I'm a little hair. I'm not too perfect, but I just still look sexy. Yeah. He's... He's... He's sexy. So I think... What do you want to do? Classic or Code Veronica? Ooh. Decisions, decision. Just have beefy fucking Chris. <laughs> beefy. It makes him less of a pussy. What, does it really bump up his stats? No, it just makes him look like less of a pussy. <laughs> <laughs> when the tyrant, uh, tyrant X comes in, he's like, Bring it on! I took down a rock and fuck you up! The tyrant's like, Is it, you ready to feel this up your butthole? He's like, You ready to feel this up your butthole? <laughs> <laughs> like, dude, with his fingers, like, Yeah! I hope you can see this! I'm doing this as hard as I can! I eat pieces of shit like you for breakfast. He's like, You eat pieces of shit for breakfast? <laughs> Fuck it, normal. <laughs> Fucking, uh, wait, you playing, oh, you're playing normal outfit. No, normal outfit. You're quoting, um, what was it, Happy Gilmore. Yeah. I eat pieces of shit like you for breakfast. Do you eat pieces of shit for breakfast? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> wow, July 1998. What were you doing in 1998? I, I was about to say masturbating. No, I was, I, I was, I was seven. I just turned seven, actually. Oh, you were seven? Yeah, I was wait, 91. Oh, that's right. Okay, so I, I was thinking, I'm eight. No, 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 I'm not eight. And by July of uh, 2000, uh, July of 1998, I'm nine years old. Yep. Damn, we're young or old or whatever. She's hot. But you ever notice that, like, in every single, like, uh, news anchor, 
or no, no I'm, I'm sorry every Spanish news anchor is like drop dead gorgeous has like slight button down cleavage and just like holding like having like that bra that's like holding those tits together just going just look at these fuck the news look at this so I might have lied I might not do knife only but I'm not gonna go around killing every I definitely can't not on hard but you're gonna try to do as much as knife as possible yes I'm gonna keep a gun with me just in case though have you actually ever watched any like Spanish network type of stuff? Yes. You know what's funny? Uh, slight spoiler, 10 second ahead spoiler. The guy who dies at, in this cutscene. Joseph. No, it's not no, Joseph. no, it's a black guy. The guy. And then the guy who dies in the mansion? Keith. Yes. They're two guy. different people on paper, but in the game, they use the same model for this guy who dies in the forest and the guy who's lying on the floor in the mansion. They use the same exact model. <laughs> well, the black guy died twice. Isn't that racist? Are you sure he's black? I mean, he could be Puerto Rican. I swear. Same exact model. Wait, wait, Bandana, hey, face, everything. No! They use the not, same model. Not, wait, in this game or in the... Or in, the in the remake. Uh, oh, okay, I was gonna say, in the first game, Keith was completely different. Like, he was, like... Mm, like, you could tell he was black. Like, he had a very dark shade of black. Like, yeah. like no, that's not burnt. That's burnt! <laughs> I mean, he wasn't that black, but he definitely, you could tell he was black. He had a goatee, and he was bald. No bandana. Jo yeah. That's not Joseph Forrest, that's Joseph something. I don't even know what his name is. It's Batman. And she's like, should I shoot? No, she did shoot. You didn't hear her gun clicking? No, that was... Then again, the, the, we're recording this and the audio is pretty low on the game and we're just No, that, that was that was Joseph that was shooting, his his pistol. Because if she no, was... No, when she was shooting, it went click, click, click. You didn't see the finger move, or if, if, it, if it did click, the, um, you know, the gun would have uh, locked back. In that scene where Joe was looking down, her face... Oh yeah, look at this, we, I think we discussed it before, but his gun is, uh, is, is, uh, the, the slide is chrome. His samurai edge is, is, is chrome, because no one actually knows what, uh, Chris's, um, samurai edge looks like. Because everyone says, oh no, it's all black and everything, like, because that's what he uses in the first game. No, that's what he gets in the first game. <laughs> I don't know, I thought, Chris this way! But he doesn't have the, uh, the under barrel. Oh, and he's got a big ass pole pipe right there. He's got this big fucking gun! Damn. What does, uh, Barry say in the, in the game with, uh, to Jill, where he's, like, saying, it's like, what about you? Oh, I've got this! I like the buddy system we have going on here. Hey. Hey. How you doing? Enter the survival, the survival horror. There are only three stars in the first Captain Wesker. Jill. Myself. Where the fuck's Barry? Didn't you all go through the front door? Is and in the when you play as Joe, Barry. did they all go through the front door? Barry, is Barry in like? It, uh, he's, well, he's in voice acting hell now. <laughs> Welcome to the fifth dimension, bitch. <laughs> he made one. And, he made one joke about a Jill sandwich. Now look at what happened. Where did uh, now? Where's Chris's pistol? Like he did what? Just dropped it? Or no? It's with Barry. <laughs> I don't understand this. Cutscene. We're all good to go. We have our weapons. Everyone run through the front door. Where the fuck did our guns and where's Barry? <laughs> like, where, where, Chris, where the fuck is your gun? How are you irresponsible about that shit? Not keeping your fucking pistol with you. Wait, oh. Oh, I have that. Uh, uh, don't worry, I won't use it. I'll put it away. <laughs> I'll put that shit away. What is that, rocket launcher? Uh, yes, it is, actually. Uh, uh, what? I can't knife him? That's okay, I'll get my pistol out later. Do you at least have a knife in, uh, in the chest? Yes, all the stuff is in the chest. Okay, so just try not to use the rocket launcher. As I don't know. <laughs> I think this might be the weapon I'll carry around just in case. <laughs> it's te you know, guys, it is tempting. Like, you want to just use the rocket launcher just one time and just call it like a. Uh, well, I a I want to go through not saving at all, so I might hold on to it just in case. <laughs> yeah, you're right. It is the same model because honestly, that's supposed to be. Uh, yep. Keith. I see you. It's Uncle Fester. Yes, it is. Apparently, Uncle Fester was supposed to. All right, come on. Come on, this way. There we go. All right, let me just, uh... A corpse, Keith, he's holding something. A All video right, there tape. we go. Never got that in the original game. Wow, he's pretty stupid, isn't he? Yeah. He's like, hey, give me a hug! I'm just gonna go through this door. So anyway... <laughs> Bitches get stitches! I feel bad. I think we should make the game just a little louder. Should we make the game a little louder next time? Well, you can't do it now. Ah, damn it. Yeah. We'll do the cutscene first. 
Now we'll uh, make this a little bit long because we technically really didn't do anything in this episode. We just picked a picked a difficulty, uh, going through menu shit. Yeah, but this this is what makes it fun. What massive cutscenes? It's not metal. I can't do. This. It's like, the intro. If I'm doing this in Metal Gear Solid, like the whole entire cut, the whole entire episode is gonna be half a cutscene, half the cutscene. <laughs> That's how long Metal Gear Solid oh, look, is. Oh, pistol. Well, that's her pistol. Oh. Now, people, so many people are saying, this is Chris's pistol. No, no, no. It even says, this is Jill's uh, pistol. It's all black with the with the silver in, uh, inner barrel. Yeah. Stars custom automatic fire, fires. It doesn't say who. I can't zoom out. There's the blue uh, thing on the side, the grip. That's the, that's the Stars logo. I know, but isn't it custom? Oh, I can zoom in. And then... Yeah, it's a, it's a Model 2 custom-made Samurai Edge uh, Beretta M92F. Does it say who it's for? No, the names are not on them. Huh. I don't know why, but it doesn't really matter. I mean, the only guy that I know that actually has the names on... Oh, excuse me. ...is um, Leon's uh, Desert Eagle hmm. that he gets as a gift, which in the book he gets it, and it's like a 10-inch barrel. I think it's sil uh, it's all silver, uh -huh. and on the... On the uh, on the grip itself, it has Le it has Leon written on it, like in a script. It's kind of cool. Now, that's like I said, that's Jill's Samurai Edge. Chris is sam Chris has a Samurai Edge as well, which he was using in the beginning. But apparently, his Samurai Edge, if I'm not mistaken, is black with the the slide of silver. Uh huh. Jill's is all black with the uh, the the barrel the barrel silver. Um, and we uh, Wesker's. I mean, in this one, I don't, it's different, but um. The one he uses in Resident Evil 6, it's, um, I'm trying to remember what it is. It's, uh, chrome on the bottom and a, bl a black slide. Mm hmm. Huh. And berries, hang on. I have berries. He has two of them, actually. One of them from Resident Evil, this game. Uh huh. Which is this one. Which is this one. It's all black. I probably should have told you to get that monitor. Which is this one. It's all black. Very nice. So it's kind of nice, and he's got the uh, the compensator and everything. Brad's got a Brad actually has a similar one to to, to this one. Huh. Brad Vix. You know the chick was it Chicken Brad, whatever his name is, uh -huh. his nickname. He actually does have a, sam a Samurai Edge as well. But why would people actually want it? His is actually similar to uh, to Barry's actually, because he also has a compensator as well. Is there no zombie up here? I don't know. And another one that Barry also has, what he's using right now, is this Samurai Edge, the Model 2, in Resident Evil Revelation. Hang on, I can't hear. What, what do you need to hear? Well, it's survival horror. I want to hear if there's a zombie. I just hear thunder and lightning. It's on very hard, there should be- it's not very hard, it's on hard, there should be a zombie. But- Was there a very hard difficulty? No, just very easy, but there's hard. But there should be a zombie here. Well then. I don't know why there isn't one. Giddy up. So this one is the new one. So this I actually do like this one. The compensator is actually much more, you know, custom made. Can't can't find these anywhere. It's upsetting. So anyway, Ouroboros will be unleashed into the atmosphere. Yeah. What is 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 he's infected right now, right? Western? No, 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 no. He in, he injects himself at the end of the game. With 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 what? We're, I, like, there's very little documentation on it. All we know is William Birkin gave it to him, and it's not the T-Virus itself. It's something else. It's not- is it Ouroboros? No. It is not. Is- is- is Wesker even infected with Ouroboros in the- in the new one? No. What the fuck is he even infected with? Oh, you know what it could be? It could be the C-Virus. Um, that's a different zombie. Hey. That's not the bald-headed fucker. Hey. 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 How you doing? You, you okay? Did you grow a hair? Where was the other dude? Do you want a glass of water? I guess not. That hit me right in the I'm face. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You okay? Yeah. You want a cookie? Yeah, see? That's the zombie that has the hair. Where the fuck? Where's the bald fucker? Is he over here? He better not be over here. But he's not dead, is he? No, he's not dead. No, so... What happened? Why did they swap the model out? That's supposed to be the bald fucker. Does it really matter? It's kinda concerning. 
since I wasn't expecting that and it's new. <laughs> I'm a scared! So anyway, I, I'm I'm gonna take this because I don't plan on coming back into this room. I don't I don't want to. Oh, wait, uh, there's a chest in there, right? Mm, yeah. No, there it was just nerve. No, no, there's a um, a chest underneath. Uh, not a chest. A um, uh, there's a room underneath the stairs that has a chest inside, right? Mm, not here. Or am I thinking of the original one then? I, I don't even know. It's just, I I don't know. This fucking mansion is way too goddamn big. Like you know what? I'll settle for the mansion in the first game and be like, I'll live in there. This one. This is too fucking big. I don't even. I'll get lost in my own goddamn home. Don't you Wait, wanna, how many? You have one herb. Want to mix them? Uh, I will. Ha I want to just take it. But then again, this could. It could be a good thing, if I'm ever running through here. But if I'm get if I'm running through here, and I'm being a shut up. Oh, he's armored up. He's not armored up. Oh well, he's fat enough to be armored up. Come on. Haha. -ha. <laughs> Oh, you don't have any, uh, uh, smoke bombs or daggers, right? No. Do, wait, do, you don't get them in this, in, in this, uh... You get them on hard mode. Oh, okay. But I just don't have them. So, while there's zombies here, let me just look at this. <laughs> you guys, but you, you guys don't bother me while I'm looking at this, this arrowhead. I'm paused, you fuckers! Uh, All right. we could, I know. Do you really want to take the magazine? Oh, hey, look, there's okay. a zombie right there, but he's not bothering me. Bother yeah. me, you prick! What do you see a zombie? In the mirror. Oh, look at that. See, I didn't see that. Oh, there he is. Finally. I think that's what it is. Like, you don't see them in the action. You don't actually pay attention to the mirror. And then do Damn it. That's okay. I got herbs. You don't pay attention to them in the mirror, and then it's like they attack you like that. So. I think that's like the survival horror type of base that they were trying to actually uh, get in. Oh, by the way, what do you, uh, what's the uh, gameplay that you're going to be doing in, in here? What do you mean? You're going through this whole entire game without saving, knife only, um, all in one in one speed run without saving, right? Something like that. Something like that. I'll have my knife and rocket launcher with me. This is gonna be fun. <laughs> hey, you wanted to do this, so I was like, okay, you go ahead and do that for the. Uh... At least let me get the fucking key before we end the episode. Shit, I'm probably gonna have to charge up my phone, unfortunately, while we're doing that. So. Hey, look, it's this fucker. Hey, I got it done. Hey. How you doing, buddy? So their mouth is like open way too wide. Wow, ah. he, he's very... Crunchy. I don't even, I don't even know. He's crunchy. Going. No, he looks like he was mauled badly. By what? I don't know. A, By a who? penis? Wait, uh, why would you... Uh, he was raped? I mean, s zombies don't have the best penises. What was that one time you were saying, like, two fucking zombies? And I oh, actually, yeah, two zombies fucking each other. No, 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 I, I, no, you said two fucking zombies, and in my head, I'm, I'm thinking, two zombies fucking. I'm like, what? Yeah, they're just fucking each other, and the penis breaks off in them, and he's like... <laughs> we were, like, well, talking about way too much about zombies at that time. What about the zombie on the bus? No, he, oh, yeah, we were talking about, like, zombies on the bus, was going... <laughs> and it just blows up the bus. They just, they just blow up the bus. Shall I read this? How long is it? Uh, one, two. Four masks. Not that long. All right. <clears throat> wait, 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 read it like a um, 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 like you're like announcing a movie. Book of Curses. The four masks. A mask that speaks no evil. A mask that smells no evil. A mask that sees no evil. A mask that cannot speak, smell, or see evil. When all four fall into place, evil will awaken this Friday. <laughs> this Friday, evil will awaken. You, you, you should upload this on Friday. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know when this is gonna get uploaded. It's probably gonna. Is get this upload fucker right here? All right, it's probably this is probably gonna get uploaded by, by this is probably today. Today, when you guys are actually watching this live, it's, well, not live, but, like, you know, when it actually comes up, it's probably going to be Monday. Hey, buddy, can I, um, can I get that ammo? But this Friday, we're probably going to be playing the same goddamn game. No, let me just use that. I don't give a fuck. That was not smart. <laughs> I thought the... I had more room to get in there. Let me just, I just want the shotgun ammo. But you're not going to, you're not going to use the shotgun. See, now you're getting people worried, being like, oh, he's not going to use that shit. Like, he's not gonna play this game legit with just a knife. He's got- he's picking up all his shit so I can fucking use it. He's got the fucking rocket line. He's gonna use that shit, you know? I keep forgetting I'm doing a knife-only run. I'm sorry. <laughs> People are gonna be so upset. I mean, at, at the moment, you haven't killed anybody yet. You haven't used your gun. You haven't used- Can I at least use the rocket on bosses? Is that okay? 
I'm gonna like, I'm probably gonna like slightly allow it, but other people are gonna be like, no, it's a knife run, you motherfucker! I'm gonna use it on the snake, the first snake encounter. I don't feel like getting poisoned. So, next time on the cooperators. It's not, but okay. Yeah, sure. All right. Next time, uh, what's gonna happen? We're gonna continue right where we left, left off, right? Yep. Okay, so we'll see you next time. <laughs> <laughs> I will stop playing right now <laughs> if you call this non again. <laughs>